to land. Hey, man, I hope all is well, man, out there in YouTube land. Hope y'all staying safe. Hope y'all healthy out there, man. Hey, RC4 Drive, man, they didn't hit us with one. They didn't put out the autobiography, limited edition, D90. Man, this thing's sweet. I already put the bead locks on it, but I got to put the center caps on my bead locks. I wasn't able to do that yet. Um, done a couple things to the car already. I'm going to snatch the plastic off, get up under the body, and show y'all what I put in here, man. I got to get all this plastic and all this tape off first. You know, man, the D90 been real famous on YouTube for years, man. I've been wanting one, wanting one. But this one... I had to have it, man. I had to have it. So, hope all the D90 lovers like this one here. Let me get this tape off right here. Can't scratch up the beautiful D90, man. Here we go. Can't wait to get her out on my backyard course. off down here so yeah one thing I noticed about this one is the older D90s if you look in the window you can see how they mount the windows on the older ones but with this model the windows is flush you can't see from the outside how they mount the windows let me get the hood open real fast okay so my wires under here man I just did my park lights and everything so I'm gonna get them all tucked out the way as soon as I get everything finished. So let me get this tape off here. So peace and love on the wires, man. <laughs> so here go the park lights here. Just wired those ones in on the side right there. <clears throat> Beautiful truck though, man. Shout out to RC Four Wheel Drive, man. They got me one over here real quick. Man, I can't complain. It was expeditiously. Shout out to RC Four Wheel Drive, man. I gotta put my bumper on there. I still haven't put my upgraded bumper on here yet. So it's a couple things. Like I say, once the review come, I gotta put my center pieces on my bead locks. So yeah, man, I was able to run the high beams. And due to the fact that the D90 has so many buckets on the front, I was able to run the low beams. And it also has the functioning blinkers on the front. So that was very sweet. And so I'm going to show you guys the tail end. On the tail, I'm running the uh, functioning brake lights. And I also have the functioning reverse lights. And the two top orange ones will be blinkers in the future. But for right now, they just park lights. So I'm going to pull the body off for you guys real quick. Show you guys what I got under here. So in the front of the car, I'm running the Protec 370 TBL brushless servo. It's actually a waterproof servo, and it's actually a Protex crawler servo, one of their better crawler servos. It's a great servo, man. I don't got no complaints. So in the tail of the car, I got a lot of my components here. I'm running the Castle B-Link. So if you're looking under these wires right here, I'm running the um, Castle B-Link right here, and I'm running the antenna list receiver with the Mamba X right here, tucked in the fuel cell down low over here. So yeah, man, you guys stay safe out there. That's my D90 setup and unboxing. Peace and love.